Hey, how's it going? It's Walsh here, sick as always. There has been a uh, significant gap in time between my brain and PoE, but I gotta tell you, these have been some of the most exciting patch notes I have ever read. I understand there are a lot of changes and nerfs that are unpopular at the moment, and I'm not even saying that the majority of people are like not happy with it, but just from like the responses I have seen, people don't seem too happy about it. It's just like nerfs all around, big, fat, slobbery nerfs. Like nerfs that make you question how many of your builds are even possible anymore. But like, all I see is Ruthless is getting more unique changes. Alterations that are not in the base game which is a good thing. That means Ruthless is gaining life. It is growing more and more into its own life. And to be honest, I'm pretty excited for that. I know I tend to ramble. So the TLDR, I would take all of these nerfs any day for plus two ascendancy points. Why are more people not talking about that? We are getting plus two. We are getting Uber Lab, okay? If they took every single ascendancy in the game and cut it in half, I would still trade that for plus two points. So that's my TLDR on the ascendancy changes. I don't care. <laughs> they gave us two points. It's cool with me, man. Uh, determination and grace. Uh, like, I, I think they slightly went too far. But to be honest, it needed to be changed. It was so easy to just like, oh, man, how do I solve like 50% of my mapping problem? Oh, I just slap on determination. There you go. <laughs> you know, like... I don't know. I, I think they went a little too far because I think it should still be a tool that like every build can use in some way if they want to work it in. But I don't know. I get it. It now forces us to be more creative and find more solutions or just be willing to sacrifice like more aspect of the build. Because for me, that is a huge part of Ruthless. At this point in time, I believe I've played what, 22 or 23 characters to maps? Granted, I've only hit level 90 twice, but in my defense, when I get excited, I just kind of, like, you know, roll the character. I'm not very good at, like, waiting to play the character. I just want to play the character. I love Ruthless, and these changes are exciting to me. Ruthless is literally my dream game, and I am more than happy to see them making patches exclusively for it. If you want me to say, like, oh, this build is dead, or this build is still barely alive, or whatever, I won't, and hopefully I never will in the future. I think that goes against the very core idea that makes Ruthless so fun, at least to me. That feeling of, or that, that being of, like, uh, what can I live without? How far can you push something that does not even have the minimum requirement you would demand in the base game? You know what I mean? Like, it's like, oh, I would norm like, normally you wouldn't play the build if you don't have that item. But what if you actually had to? What if you had to? I don't know. Like, what if, I don't know. I, I get that, like, I'm kind of going off the rails a little bit, and I apologize about that. I know most people, or not most, some people are seeing these nerfs and being like, what the heck, why? But I hope there's at least one other weird weirdo out there like me that also feels this way because I love Ruthless and uh, I don't want it to go away. <laughs> I'll be really sad. Anyway, that's all I have to say about the patch notes. Now I'm going to be going to roll my League Starter Ascendancy and talk about this wise plans and changes. If you don't care about anything that I'm doing, uh, I just want to say thank you for watching and uh, I hope I didn't waste your time. All right, I'm going to randomize my Ascendancy. I get to choose my skill and the build and all that. Ruthless is hard enough, okay? Give me a break. I'm sorry. Uh, anyway, whenever I roll here, I have to. Uh, the goal is I have to complete a red tier map, a tier 11, have to kill the map boss. And uh, I know that doesn't really sound like anything in the base game, but on Ruthless, with some of the garbage I make, it can be pretty hard. Anyway, let's see what we get. Wait, where's the thing? Oh my god! We got Necromancer? What? Uh, what happened to Necro? I don't even remember. Trash. Uh, also, on PoE Planner, it is updated, so you can see the uh, new stuff. At least last I knew. Okay, Necro looks the exact same. Well, that guy is... I was gonna say that sucks, but actually that's kinda awesome. Oh, dude, isn't there a new, uh, isn't there a new SRS gem? Alright, uh, sorry for the no reaction, but, uh, Necromancer's just kind of like a safe bet. 
I'm not saying it's going to be good, but all right, cool. All right, well, we have a uh, solid league starter. Anyway, really quickly, I just want to talk about uh, some changes I'm going to be making to the series this time around. Uh, I kind of want to refine it a little more. That way I can go back and look and search for certain things. So what I'm going to try doing this league is every single... I have a new rule. Every single time I roll a new character, I have to make a quick build... Or sorry, a quick video, even if it's only two minutes long, explaining the character, having maybe one, two, or three POBs, like what it started with, how I changed it, and maybe like what I would have liked to have done with with it or something like that i don't know i don't know exactly what i'm gonna do but yeah i i really think that would make it easier for me to go back because for me like i just really like to collect builds and what happens for me is a lot of the times when i'm playing a character and i get something cool and i re-roll i always think there's gonna be more time for me to go back to the last build and grind even more but what happens is you're playing this new awesome build and then you know like <laughs> Two weeks later, something else awesome drops. And then you never go back. There's never enough time. So I just want to collect them. That way I can always have my POBs. When I lost my last computer because of like whatever happened to my hard drive, I'm not really a technical guy, but it died. <laughs> Everything died. That's all I know. And uh, I lost like 200 or something POBs. So uh, I'm basically naked again. All right. Well, I guess I'll be on uh, POB for the rest of today. And then I'll probably forget about it until Thursday panic and uh just improvise on the spot anyway thank you for watching i really appreciate it and uh, i'll see you on friday